Hello YouTube, I just wanted to do a quick video of some recent acquisitions of mine. Um, no sports cards to show today, so those of you who are um, used to seeing sports cards on this channel, um, I encourage you to uh, continue watching and check out some of my newest US currency that I've picked up. Go ahead and start off with these two. These are both um, 1933, I'm sorry, 1934 series, uh, $1 silver certificates. They're both in a bound and circulated condition. All these purchases were made from appmix.com, American Precious Metals Exchange. So if you're ever interested in buying any gold, silver, currency, collectible coins, I would definitely recommend checking them out. No one can beat their selection and they have a really great customer service fast shipping a lot to like about them so these silver certificates were the last year of the so-called funny bags the following year in 1935 i believe is <clears throat> when the backs changed to the one that we all know today so a neat part of history there 1934 series, $1 silver certificates. These next two were pretty substantial purchases for me. Here we have a 1966 series, $100 United States note. I'll go ahead and take it out of the protective sleeve. So the sticker's not in the way. This note is also in a bound and circulated condition. You can see a fold down the middle. But it's in relatively nice shape. As I just told you, it's a 1966 series. However, this note could have been printed any time between 1966 and January of 1971 when the uh, printing of these notes ceased. Worth noting that it's a United States note and not a Federal Reserve note. If you look at the cash in your pocket now, it'll say Federal Reserve note and have a green seal. This has the red seal and red serial numbers. In the back is the familiar picture of Independence Hall. I had my eye on this for a while and finally had an opportunity to pick it up. So I went ahead and did that. Next up is an even cooler note. This is an $18.99 $1 silver certificate. Now, even though it's an $18.99 silver certificate, that's not when it was printed. That's just when this series was first issued. This particular note was printed sometime between March of 1915 in November of 1919. Here's the back. Very interesting back. Let's see if we can read what it says here on the back. It says, this certificate is receivable for customs, taxes, and all public dues, and when so received, it may be reissued. It says United States of America, silver certificate. This note is also known as the Black Eagle for obvious reasons. It features portraits of Presidents Lincoln and Grant at the bottom. Very intricate design, which appeals to me, but it's got some blue, hint, blue hits that make the, the note pop. So there you have it, folks. Some currency pickups. Um, I don't imagine I'll be buying any more currency for a while. There's some other things I'd like to get, um, such as silver bullion. But I'm really thrilled that I pulled the trigger on these. I couldn't be happier. 
That's it, folks. Thanks for watching.